Hello, everyone, and welcome to another News Coulomb video. I'm here at the uh, Sixth Street Park in Sacramento charging at an EVgo charging station. It's 375 kilowatt ABB chargers with CCS ports, but these are dual standards, so they also have the Chatamo. And this is sort of a rarity right now, but it's worth calling out. They also have 300 kilowatt Chatamo connectors, which again, they're sort of rare right now. EVgo is one of the few companies that's actually supporting the faster charging for Chatamo. So if you have a Nissan Leaf E+, Plus, this is a good spot for you because those chargers are going to be able to maximize the charging rate of your vehicle. There are also three additional 50 kilowatt chargers. Uh, you know, it's by a park. It's pretty dark right now. I don't know if there are really any sort of facilities around. Uh, and so I'm not going to be here for very long, but I, yeah, I'm not sure how effective of a stop this would be for people under you know normal driving circumstances. It's at least uh, right off the freeway. It'll get you charged up really quick. The one thing that I don't like about this configuration though is the way they have them set up with the bump stops. It's actually very difficult to reach around the fender to access a charging port and hook up uh, just because of the way the angle is. As you pull in, you're literally putting your charge port further away from the vehicle and forcing the cord to bend back on itself. So it's not the most effective configuration in that regard. These chargers, I think, are really designed to be perpendicular to the vehicle that's charging on them. I don't know if EVgo had considered angling the chargers in the same angle as the uh, parking spaces, but the way they're configured right now, it actually makes it very difficult to hook up. But either way, overall, I think it's a nice sight. I, you know, I might stop by sometime when there's actually some sun out so I can get a better uh, lighting. But again, that's another uh, knock on this charging station. There's not a whole lot of lighting here. So if you're here after hours, I mean, it's available 24 hours a day, but it, it's not very well lit. I, I would have some issues concerns with security and safety and whatnot but it's great to see faster than 50 kilowatt chargers available and it's definitely great to see faster than a 50 kilowatt chatamo as well let me know what you think have you used this charger i hear it's pretty busy during the day so you know i'm here at basically at midnight coming through town so uh, nobody here if you enjoyed this video please like and subscribe it really helps out the channel it lets me uh scout out some of these charging stations, let you guys know what's up, and uh, thank you for watching.